now when my lighting is on, the ADC is about 967. When I turn off the lights, it got about 500. And then I use my phone flashlight. Welcome back to Milliom YouTube channel. Now in this video we will talk about LDR. So what is an LDR? Please don't start. It is not long distance relationship, but it is light dependent resistor. Or we can just call it a photoresistor. From its name we know that it is a resistor that affected by light means it is passive component that has correlation between how much light that exposed the surface. So let's just start the experiment to understand what I said. I will measure the resistivity of this LDR use a multimeter and I will vary or change the light intensity that exposed the LDR. First, when my lighting is on, the resistance is about 617 ohm and then I try to turn off the lighting and it reads about 14 kilo ohm and when I cover the LDR surface with my hand it reads about 100 k ohm And then I turn back on the lighting and put my phone flashlight to the LDR and this is what I got. So we can make conclusion that when the light intensity is increasing, the resistance is decreasing. So the resistance and light intensity is inversely proportional. Now the big question is, how do you use this LDR as a sensor? For example, if we want to use Arduino, how to make this LDR is readable by Arduino since Arduino only able to read voltage, not resistance. The answer is simple. Convert the resistance to voltage. So how do we do that? Use the voltage divider. This is the circuit. So this circuit has the ability to convert the resistance to voltage. This is how it works. We can take voltage output from the middle of R1 and R2. The change of 1R will change the voltage output. This is the formula. So for example, if we use fixed R1, that is 10K, and R2 is the LDR, which is variable resistor, we can take voltage output from the middle resistor between R1 and R2. We can calculate the output voltage. So for example, if the LDR is 14K, then this is the output. And another example, say the LDR at 617 ohm. So here's the voltage output. And we can see that when the resistance is increased, the voltage output is increased too. This means that when the light intensity is increased, the voltage is decreased. The brighter, the less voltage output. So let's get our hand dirty by trying in the real life circuit. So I will make the circuit like this schematic. I connect the 10k resistor to the LDR and connect another end of resistor to 5V and another end of LDR to ground. And I take the output to analog zero of Arduino at the junction between the LDR and 10k resistor. Now open the Arduino IDE and just upload the analog read example from Arduino IDE to read the output of the LDR sensor. Wait, before we continue the video, 
you can make me really happy by subscribing to this channel and tap the bell so you won't miss new video from me. We can see at the left that is the IDC of Arduino at pin analog 0. When my lighting is on the IDC reads about 54. Then I turn off the light, the IDC changes to about 480. Then I cover the LDR using my hand and it got about 1000. I turn on the light again and add more light using my phone flashlight. It got about 30, 20. I turn off the light again and I try use my phone flashlight only and this is the result. And again I try to cover the LDR with my coin and this is what I got. So maybe you wonder how if you want to make the ADC increased when the lighting is increased? So it's easy, just exchange the resistor with LDR. So now the LDR is at R1 and the 10K resistor is at R2. So I just move the end of resistor to the ground and another end of LDR to 5V. Now when my lighting is on, the ADC is about 967. When I turn off the lights, it got about 500 and then I use my phone flashlight Try to cover the LDR with a lens cover. The ADC is read zero. So when we exchange the LDR and resistor, now we got the brightness of the lamp and the ADC is linear. So turn on LDR into a sensor is easy, right? Let me know your result in the comment section below. And as usual, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell button to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks for watching and see you on another videos. Bye.